Trump proved once again that he has his finger on the pulse of what Americans are really concerned with right now. Watch. By the way, how bad were the Academy Awards this year? Did you see it? And the winner is a movie from South Korea. What the hell was that all about? <laughs> we got enough problems with South Korea with trade. On top of it, they give him the best movie of the year. Was it good? I don't know. <laughs> you know, I'm looking for like, where, where, let's get Gone with the Wind. Can we get like Gone with the Wind back, please? Yeah, I thought it was best foreign film, right? <laughs> best foreign movie. No, it was the, did this ever happen before? Yeah, the, let's bring back the good old days. Yeah, yeah. let's get Birth of a Nation back up in there because <laughs> yeah. we don't have enough of that kind of kowtowing and cooning. Yeah. But what's interesting is that. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Uh, Thank you. you know, well, I, listen, I, I, I think that's why he's upset. I think that when, when he saw the name Parasite <laughs> of the movie, the he thought it was the Trump family film. Uh -oh. <laughs> he was referring to Rudy Giuliani. Uh, oh, oh, but, uh, but, uh, but, but, you know, the, the irony and the tragedy here is this, is that if we say to, uh, in America, bring your best wares, show them off, we are a nation that is international. Of course. Look, we didn't say anything when Joaquin Phoenix won the BAFTA award in, in British culture. Yeah, they gave yeah. it to him for Joker. Yeah. Why yes. is it that we have to have xenophobia and to show your uh, intellectual and artistic passport before you can be received? Thank God for international art. Thank God for Parasite. If Trump were to actually ever look at it, yeah. he would see a profound engagement with human themes and ideals oh, that are you know, that he's allergic is, to. But you know, there is zero <laughs> chance right. that, I mean, too many subtitles, There's too much reading. That's, oh. what, that's, oh. reading. Wait, that's yeah. what the guy who wrote Parasite, the, the writer and the director yeah. said he can't Nine read. Too much, that's the problem. Too much, too much reading. Too much. But I think, also, to, the, yeah. the aspect of let's bring back Gone with the Wind. Yes. Yeah. yes, why don't we bring back Mamie with a handkerchief on her head? Yes. Let's bring back the Civil War. <laughs> let's bring back Slave. Well, why don't we do that? I don't know about no babies. Right? That's what that's what <laughs> struck me. I mean, I know he was born in 1946 and Gone with the Wind, the movie came out in 1940, so he was six years old. <clears throat> what has always struck me was this Make America Great Again theme, oh, right? Yeah. When was America great to him? Right. And if it was great when Gone with the Wind came out <laughs> with all those caricatures right. um, that, that, the, and stereotypes and, and racial tropes. Mm. Um, I, I thought what he said was really um, sort of instructive and reflective of what but goes the movie on. That, the color. movie that's mm. more to the point about his administration is The Godfather. Let's right. face it. Well, definitely. Well, yeah, definitely. But that except, is, but that's except where it's he an went. insult to The Godfather to compare him. You know, why didn't you come to me first? <laughs> uh, you know, he can't even stand in Marlon Brando's shadow for that <laughs> like, reason. But the, the kind of anarchic, chaotic, uh, fascist impulse. There's mm -hmm. no question about that. Yeah. yeah. But Gone with the Wind is about subordinating black people to white folk. Let's just be real yeah, about it. It's about the old That's South. That's the idea. We have right. a few seconds. South. Do you have any thoughts on this, Mike? Uh, Gone with the Wind's about the Civil War. It's a yeah. slave movie. Yeah. It's a slave it's a movie. Yeah. Yeah. With racial, with racial yeah, tropes. Right. I've seen it. And what, they were also happy. There. It is a All the slaves in that movie, movie were happy. Wasn't I mean, it absolutely. Like, come yes. on. I mean, right. They were, you know, the, the misinterpretation. And, and what's interesting to me, the, the, the rearticulation of the Confederacy, I thought we were against participation trophies. You lost the war. It's like the, it's like the team that lost the Super Bowl has an anniversary every year of when we <laughs> lost the Super Bowl. Right. It's also right. a very sexist movie. Remember the scene at the end when he raped her basically the next day? Oh like, God, Ooh, well, when it comes, yeah. listen, when it comes to Trump being yeah. a movie critic, here's what I have to say. Frankly, my dear, I don't I give don't, a damn. Right. <laughs>